welcome back to my channel or if you are new here then welcome my name is Ashley and today we are going to be opening up a subscription box so I just got in my so kawaii sub September box uh, like last week or something and I'm finally getting around to opening it and I'm really excited because I'm pretty sure the theme of this box was like the back to school theme so I can't wait to see what goodies they put inside of this box for the month of September. So just a little bit about this box before we go ahead and open it up. Um, this box does come directly from Tokyo, Japan, and um, they do ship internationally. I live here in California in the US, and it doesn't take them that long to get me my box. Actually, I usually get it around the 10th or so of the month, which I feel like is really great for international shipping. Um, it does cost me, I think, between 43 and $47 with shipping included. So. Um, not too too bad for something that's not US based um, but the cool thing is because it comes from Tokyo so all of the items are from Japan they're not something that I would be able to readily find here in California which I really do love so another really fun thing about their boxes aside from their super adorable packaging is um, they will do like a theme so I'm pretty sure that this month's theme was like the back to school and then they will pick like a few different like characters that will be featured inside of the box so it could be like Sanrio characters it could be Pokemon characters it could be Disney characters so it really just depends um, so I cannot remember the characters that were gonna be featured in this box but I am really excited to get in here and see what we got so we're just gonna go ahead and open this box right on up I haven't peeked at it or anything I did just cut the tape so we you know don't have to fumble with that on camera but let's go ahead and open this box up and see what they included in their September box. So the other thing I really love about their boxes is it is so cute. It is this really pretty blue covered in all of these stars. And then the inside, it's like this really hot pink. We've got some little cherry blossoms. There's some little clouds and a heart and a little cat over here on this side. So it's just a really cute box. And then here is the items. We have some really pretty pink tissue paper and then there is like the little packing slip, so to speak. It's just a little card that they put everything, uh, or they put a list of everything that's gonna be included inside of the box. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this box off to the side and we will dig through it and see all the different items that they sent. So just taking a quick look at this little sheet here, it does say that the theme for this box is after school party, which is very fitting since September is like back to school month. Well, I guess like August, September, it's like the back to school time of the year. So I'm really excited to get into these items. Okay, so the first item I am pulling out of the box is a little tiny notebook, it looks like. I mean, it's kind of cute. I don't know who the character is on here. I'm going to take it out of the packaging and see if it is just like a plain notebook or what it is. Yeah. So it is just a plain like little lined paper notebook. It's kind of cute. I don't really see a purpose for this since it's so tiny. Like really what, what can I use this for? Um, hmm. I don't know about this one. Let me bring it up to the camera and I'll give you guys a close up. So here is what the front of the notebook looks like. I mean, I do like this design on here. It features an anime character and I have no idea who this is. I'm sure once I read the little slip, um, it'll tell me. And here is the paper. Like it is pretty cute. It's just, it's so tiny. Like I don't know what I would possibly be able to use this for. So the little sheet here says, it's calling all card captor Sakura fans. This handy mini ring note is perfect for cute writings. The front comes with a pretty hard cover featuring Sakura. The inside features a lovely Kiro-chan design cutely printed on each page. So, eh, I mean, it's cute, but it's not something for me. It's not something that I can see myself using. This is kind of a bust. Okay, so the next item I'm pulling out of the box is actually a super, super great item. It's very, very useful, especially in this day and age. Um, it is a pack of silicone reusable straws with a little My Melody carrying case. So here are the straws. It comes with two silicone reusable straws as well as the little straw cleaner and then this really cute little carrying case for them. 
So the sheet here says, this stylish Sanrio character pocket straw set includes two reusable straws that can be rolled up into a lovely pocket sized carrying case. It also comes with a straw cleaner, four characters available at random, cinnamon roll, my melody, kurumi, and pom pom purin. Yeah, so this is really gonna come in handy. Um, I know Disneyland, as well as a lot of restaurants around San Diego, um, they do have paper straws only now. So, you know, when you have like mixed drinks or you know like frozen type of drinks um, this one absolutely comes in handy like my fiance and I love to take these kinds of straws to Disneyland because it's really hard to drink certain things with a paper straw so this one I'm actually very very pleased to receive all right so moving right along the next item I am pulling out oh this is cute it's like a little it's a magnetic little clip thing so here is the little clip on the picture right here. It shows um, like hanging up a recipe card or something. So I can definitely see myself using this. I do love to hang pictures up on my fridge. So this one will absolutely come in handy. And it is really, really cute. So it says here, add cute yet practical fun to your office, kitchen, or any room with this adorable My Melody magnetic clip. The clip mechanism can hold any cute notes and also features a large magnet on the back, perfect to attach to any metal surface you'd like. So I definitely am pleased with this item as well. So, so far we're two for three, which isn't bad for like a random mystery box where I can't put any preferences in. Okay guys, let's go ahead. I think there's only two more things left. Yes, there's two more things left. So the next thing that I am pulling out, what is this? Okay, so the item is actually a little pencil case and it is pretty cute. Um, it just has like this little character all over it who initially when I saw this, I thought it was gonna be like Armin from the Attack on Titan Junior High anime, um, which it's definitely not him, but uh, it is Umari-chan, and I have no idea who that is or what he is from, but this is actually kind of a cute one. Yeah. So this character is actually really cute. I love all the different facial expressions. I love how they're hugging that little bottle of soda as well. And then it's the same thing on the back. And then it does have like that zipper opening, and then here is the inside. So this is actually not something that I personally have a use for. I mean, I don't really need to carry like pencils or pens or anything around in a little case. However, my cousin is about to go off to college. Um, so I can probably go ahead and give this to her because she'll be, you know, going back and forth between classes. So she actually can get some use out of this maybe. We'll see. Okay, so the little note here says, reveal your true otaku side with this adorable pencil case from the popular anime series Himotu Umaru-chan. Is that how you say it? I'm not sure. I've never heard of this anime before. Um, the colorful design features an all-over print of Umaru-chan and her cute chibi facial expressions. It definitely is a very cute little pencil case. Again, it's just not really an item that I personally can have any use for. Alright guys, okay, so we're down to the final item of this box and this actually is the item that they did like a sneak peek release for on their Instagram and this is the one that I think I'm probably going to like the most. Oh my gosh, you guys, this item is so cute. So it is an adorable pom pom porin Sakura plushy bag. Like, it's a purse. This is so, so cute. Oh my gosh, let me bring it up to the camera and give you all a close-up. So here's what the little bag looks like. I love pom pom porin's face. Uh, I love the little sakura flower here. Those are like my favorite flowers. I think that they are just so, so pretty. This purse, <laughs> I want to call it a plush because it's so squishy and so soft. Like I absolutely love this so much. It does have a little um, like strap here and then it does have a zipper pocket here where it actually looks like it can hold a good amount of stuff in there. So that's actually pretty cute. I don't know if I would actually use this as a purse, but the nice thing is um, these straps are, or the, the actual strap is detachable, so if you wanna just have it as a little plushie, you can totally have it as just a little plushie. Okay, so the little slip here says, this adorable Pom Pom Barin, a So Kawaii exclusive edition, woo, is the new addition to your collection of cute bags. Super soft and pretty with the sakura flower details embroidered. There's plenty of space inside to carry school, work, or daily essentials. So this is a really, really adorable item. I probably would just 
take off the strap and keep it sitting like on my shelf as a plushie, but I really, really like this little dude. All right, guys, so that was everything in the September So Kawaii box. I didn't love this box. I didn't dislike this box. I feel just kind of okay about it. To be completely honest, I honestly didn't even mean to get this month's box. Um, I really am interested in getting the October box since it's going to be like all Halloween kind of themed characters. I'm really excited to see what they're going to do for that box. After the, after the next month's box though, I might actually stop with this service. I do get really cute items. Some of them are useful, some of them aren't, and I just don't want to keep spending money on a little a box full of really cute items, but items that I probably won't have a use for. So we'll see what happens after next month's box. I may end up still getting the December box depending upon if they're going to be doing like a seasonal, like a Christmas or a holiday themed box for that one as well. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, I mean, overall majority of the box I really did like and I can get some use out of. So at least it wasn't a total loss. Definitely, if I had to pick a favorite item, it would be this little plush bag here. I think that this is so cute. I love the color pink it is. I love the little like cherry blossoms on here or the sakura blossoms on here. So it is just really, really pretty and super, super cute. I don't know, it's just an adorable little plush. Whatever, I like plush. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of this box. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, what your favorite item was, if you have a favorite item. I'm interested to know. All right, guys. Well, that was everything I have for today. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you as a part of this little Disney YouTube family here. Anyways, guys, thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you are having a magical day. And I will talk to you all next time.